here of Jamie's Faces on behalf of FacePaintingTips.com to show you this jack-o'-lantern face paint design. Special thanks to my son, Ben, for modeling. I had to buy him a video game to do this. Um, so I went in with a rather dry sponge with Metallic Orange by Diamond Effects and just quickly applied that base all over his face um, in an oval shape. First drawing that oval and then filling it in, leaving plenty of space on the forehead and around on the sides. Okay, now I have a, a sponge with, again, it's rather dry, and here we have um, yellow by tag on the sponge, and I'm just dotting it just to cover his eyes. And now I'm going in with some white so that it gets brighter toward the center like there's a light glowing from within. Here I have a one inch flat brush and <clears throat> on the brush is just um, a light wash of black. It's not solid black. Um, it's just a little bit of black and water and then I dabbed it off onto a paper towel so it wasn't too wet. And we're just creating these um, pumpkin shaped curves because when the jack-o'-lantern is lit from within, like it has a candle inside and it's nighttime, the pumpkin itself is darker and the light is emanating from inside and shining out through the eyes and mouth. Here we have a number six round brush with yellow um, by tag mixed with white. And I pulled just from the corners of the mouth straight up toward the ears. And he, my son is very silly and he never stops talking as you can see. Um, so here and then we pull the teeth downward and then upward along that midline. And now we're putting on the jack-o'-lantern nose with a mix of white and yellow and just going around the eyes. I have a um, soft filbert brush here and going with that, um, just blending the yellows all together to solidify that color. And here I have a number four round with black and we're outlining the shape of the pumpkin. And outlining the eye holes. And the nose hole, just by placing the brush and pulling it. It doesn't have to be very precise. Here I went ahead and outlined these teeth. And um, you could do the teeth in, in more rectangular shapes. You have them zigzagging. Um, you know, you just want to look up jack-o'-lantern clip art or images and see what kind of inspirations you can come up with. Now I'm adding this stem here. I just did it in a wash of black and then we're going to add in some green, dark green, diamond effects. He was getting real silly at that point. <laughs> you could offer glitter to them. Um, you could embellish it with some white highlights. He was just silly and done. <laughs> Hope you guys have a great Halloween. And I hope you guys are inspired by this jack-o'-lantern, this paint design. Thank you. Bye.